Hey, JB here, Fort Smith, Arkansas. Got a uh, target set down downrange, 150 yards, and there's an Air Gun Depot golf ball sitting down there on top of a tin can that's on top of a bucket. 150 yards, we've got a Walther LGU Varmint here. A fairly new gun. I've put maybe, I don't know, 30 rounds through it. So it's really not even broken in yet. Uh, and then I've got a, a 4 to 12 by 40 adjustable objective scope on here. Uh, it's a really smooth shooter. Uh, you can tell some, ah, we'll see, inconsistencies in pellet, perhaps, uh, diameter. Um, I'm attempting to do this with an 18 grain JSB. So, uh, yeah, might as well get at it, see if I can uh, get this 150 yard shot for my long ranger patch. One. Huh. Did I mention this is a Springer, not a PCP? on that real quick. Zoom in. Zoom in. Zoom in. Shot two. You gotta go, you gotta come with. Come with. Let's go see if I actually hit the thing or what. Right. Shot two. Keep it rolling. <laughs> come on, jeez. If I did this, if I did this in two shots with that LGU varmint and 18 grain pellet. That's bragging rights for me, baby, because I am not that great of a shot. I don't shoot a lot. You know the old saying that if you like to do something, don't work in that industry because you don't get to do it? Like I used to work in the finish, fishing industry and you didn't get to fish. Same thing here. You work in the shooting industry, you don't get to shoot. So I don't shoot a whole ton of a lot. I get to watch everybody else shoot, usually behind the cameras or whatever. If I pulled this off, if I pulled this off, I got a patch. My long ranger patch. You think I hit it? I got a cameraman. His name is, Ch his name is Chad. My eyes aren't that good. I can't see that far. <laughs> it's not on the it's not on the can. The can's still standing up. Second shot. I watched Rossi's little PCP gun at 150 yards. He was using the gauntlet, and he said somebody do it with a springer. We'll see, Rossi. Look at it. There's a pellet. There looks like what I'm going to assume is shot one right here. There's a pellet lying here. Okay, this was on top of the can. You saw it in the camera when he zoomed in. And sitting there. Maybe. These things lose a lot of energy at 150 out of a Springer. You can see it hits something. Is that pellet shaved off there? Air Gun Depot, you guys might have to uh, make the call on this one. I don't know if I can do it again. I keep coming back to that one mark, but I think that's a defect in the ball.
It did bust, but can was still sitting there. Can didn't move. Can was still sitting there. There, there are no marks in the can. You can see the pellet's got a. I got to call out a hit, guys. I got to call out a hit. You saw it in the camera. It was sitting there. It was sitting there. I wonder, I wonder what I think, because all that, what I think happened there is it hit that ball, scraped that pellet off, and then comes at this at an angle is why that's so, you know, so such a weird hole in the target there. And then the pellet's lying there and we walked up. That's what I think happened. It's gotta be. 150 yard shot, LGU Walther, LGU Varmint, 18 grain JSB. Air Gun Depot, Long Ranger shot, JB out. All right, Chad, you were my witness, right? But Air Gun Depot, we gotta call this a hit. And, and here's why, because uh, I put 30 or so rounds down range, just practicing a little bit, you know, figure out where this pellet's hitting, where this gun's hitting, what it's doing, and these pellets, these 18 grain pellets are dropping fast when they get out to 150 yards out of a Springer, out of this Springer, out of this Walther LGU uh, varmint. Uh, Air Gun Depot, I'm gonna tell you, the thump, I, yeah, there's a jet going overhead. We're near, we're, near, we're near an airport, but the thump that this pellet was making on that cardboard was much different than the thump that it made when it hit that golf ball. And it didn't hit the tin. The pellet didn't hit the tin because that would have been a distinctive tink sound. And the pellet itself, we showed you at the target, you know, was marred to one side. So, so here's what I believe happened, and I, and I left the ball down there, but here's what I believe happened. Here's what I know happened, All right? So the, here's the, the, the ball. You've got the ball. The pellet's coming in. It's dropping because you saw that little mar in the target over here you know, where, the, where, the, where the pellet hit the, the backer board, okay? So the pellet's dropping, comes in, hits the side of that golf ball, and then reflects off over into this target here at a side angle. And it didn't go the wall all the way through, it, and it still had enough energy yet that it bounced off of that backer board and fell onto the bucket there right beside the tent that you saw. So that is a 150 yard long ranger shot with a Walther LGU Varmint Springer. A Springer, Rossi Morielli. Bring it on.